that match, not an honest mistake, because that's not my fault. But this this fish and uh, feather switch up is an honest mistake. That should be it. Boom. Man, I'm mad about that match thing. Okay, whatever. We got it right. We're here. Mad about the match. I smell victory. I smell delicious victory. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. I'm ready. Let's bring the stones back. <laughs> no, he's, he can't have the same hit <laughs> as everybody else. <laughs> yes, we'll start with the fire. Okay. Coltram has awakened. Coltram is alive. On the top of the mountain, he will be waiting for you. He has my lovely wizard hat. Bring it to me. Uh, your hat? <laughs> yes, the stones are hiding in my wizard tools. That's why I can't remember a thing. Ha 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 But now I'm remembering. Go to the top of the mountain and find Coltram. Then come back when you have the hat. Then we can do the other things. All right, sir. I'll bring your hat. All right, I'll bring your hat. I'm so glad we figured that out. I'm just so mad that I spent so much time wandering around here. I thought snow had something to do with it. I thought it was ice. But I was like, that doesn't burn fiercely. I thought it was coal. But, oh, there's your wizard hat. It's got a face, doesn't it? Yep, called it. Oh, who dares to wake me up? Oh, I have to go. <laughs> I'm Fred. Oh my goodness, you are alive. I'm sorry to bother you, sir. I'm Fred. Fred, I see. I don't know what that means. Well, I don't really know what it means. It's just my name. Oh, all right. Mine is Coltrum. Do you know why? Sure, tell me. That's not answering his question, friend. Coltrum means born in heaven. I used to be a star. <laughs> I used to be on Broadway. People would line the block to see me as I premiered in the newest films. You know what's crazy about that? His names actually, to me, did used to have meaning. You didn't just name your kid something random like Veronica or, or Chris or John or Debbie. Like, or especially like last names, uh, 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 Wright, which is my last name, usually implied that you were a writer. That was your trade. That was your your skill. Or uh, I can't think of another name off the top of my head, but uh, Long John. Maybe you <laughs> were a guy whose family was known for your Long Johns. Y'all made Long Johns and you were Long Johns. You, names used to have, mean, have meaning, and now people are just like, well, that sounds cool, so throw it on them. Or even like modern days, look at Keanu, uh, Keanu Reeves. His name means like the ocean breeze, which suits the coolest guy in Hollywood right now uh, so well. So if you have a kid, name him something that means something. And that's my little spiel. And because I was born in space, it's very logical. Oh, wow. I've never met a star in person. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Fran. So, what brings you here? The great wizard told me to get the hat. So, if you don't mind... I can't do that. I'm divorced. I didn't ask you about your ring. I said the hat. What do you mean divorced? I just need the hat, sir. It's very important. I can't. If I give you the hat, the entire land will suffer. You'll have to find another way to get home. How does he know I want to go home? I never told you that I want to go home. The king told me that there's no other way. Please, help me. I told you 
I can't. My wife left me. She was the one covering my top. What were you married to? If I take off the hat, my magma can erupt and kill everyone, including you. Good reason to keep the hat? I'll have to figure something out. I'll get her back. What happened? No, what happened? What do you... What? Talk to me. I'll be your therapist. What happened? I don't want that. What happened with your wife? She... She decided that to walk. I'm sorry. Oh, God. It's hard to talk about. Uh, she decided that it was time for her to start her own island. Is it the tiny island in the water where tiny people live? So... She broke up with me. I didn't get the chance to ask her why. Maybe she was tired of giving you top. <laughs> I miss her so much. I'm sorry for that. That was that was bad. I should have made that joke. <laughs> that was a bad joke. Uh, oh, so now is she her own island? Huh. Do you know where she is? I think she's on the water. Otherwise, I would very strongly feel her presence. But I don't. Oh, my love, my beloved wife. I'll go and see if I can find her, all right? Then you give me the hat. Only if she comes back. Otherwise, you know what can happen. You all die. Painfully. Can't I put something else on top of your head, sir? Like a rock or something instead? Nope. I like this hat. <laughs> How did the hat get up there? Why did he put the hat on the rocks? <laughs> on the star mountain top head. All right. I'll be right back. Will we, friend? Or are we going to meet another puzzle where I get stuck for 30 minutes? Let's go. Uh, we know what island he's talking about. We know how to get there. What the? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, oh my god! That is, without a doubt, the creepiest thing I have seen in this entire game. By far, the abs. That is terrifying what I am looking at right now. The kids' faces stretched and mouse like I was not expecting that and then the the bad ghoul looking creature like if y'all seen sinister bad cool bad ghoul who like operates in the film world and ah that is terrifying does she even have heads or is her hair that is freaking terrifying dude. oh my god look at them I know you are all... I, I don't even know if I can do a voice for her. Cause they're drawn in such a way, I don't know if I can do it service. Like, that is so good. I know you are all alone. Let me be your mommy. Let me feed you. Come to my side. If you were gonna corrupt me and bring me to your side, I wouldn't use these children as an example of what I'm gonna look like afterwards. And you will have many new friends to play with. I don't want you as my mommy. You look very scary and, and I don't like you. I don't like her either, Fred. Mr. Midnight, turn around and look at what the fuck is at your back, man. Ron, who are you talking to? Oh, he doesn't see it. Huh? The, the woman standing. Uh, uh, it's nothing, Kitty. That was creepy. That was legitimately creepy. That was the creepiest thing I've seen in this game. What the f was that, man? I hope she doesn't pop back up. That is creepy. And it's just like Bagul's story, right? Because he like kids that he kidnaps kids and basically feeds on their soul, and then they do like uh, his bidding, and like they come back all messed up. Well, at first they show up as normal kids, but as time goes on in the second one anyway, they become more deformed and the true form comes out. Bagul is a hell of a creature. I don't want to see that family again. Not you. I need your boat, man. I need your boat. Urgent matters. Urgent matters. 
That was not there before. Did she just grow because she heard her husband wake up, or what, what happened there? <laughs> it's the top of a mountain. <laughs> Let's talk to the top of the mountain. Hello? Miss? Wake up. I have a message for you. Oh, hello. A messenger. What a good day. Yes, miss. I'm the messenger of love. Love? Oh, but you are not pink. Pink? No, I'm, I'm the brown and green love messenger. Perf. And does the messenger of love have something to share? I gotta bring you back. Yes, of course. I'm here in the name of love to bring you back to your husband, The Rock. No. He made me very sad. Nobody has the right to make me sad. What, uh, what did he do? Well, maybe he didn't mean to harm you. What did he do? He was so hot. And then I fell in love with that. Most stories go that way. Then you get older, looks go away, it's not the same anymore. But lately, he was cold and boring. So I felt left aside. I cried so many times. He used to grow a beautiful red flower just for me. To show his love for me. But this year, nothing came up. And you know what? I am the one protecting him all the time. So I want some credit for that. That's all. I'll find the flower. But, miss, if I find that flower for you, would you come back? I guess. But I have no hope. Besides, I'm the ruler of my own island now. It's small, but it's home. The <laughs> Mr. Midnight... <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Midnight's not having this. I'll go and see if I can find the red flower. Do you know where it grows? Always at the bottom. It's very different from all other flowers. The bottom of what, miss? My husband's bottom, of course. Bring it to me and I shall return to him. Your husband's bottom? What kind of freaky deaky stuff are y'all doing? I gotta go to his bottom. He checked his bottom and he had no flower going at, huh? Alright, well, let's find his bottom. I don't actually know where his, um, his bottom is, per se. I do know that I don't want to see that creepy family again. That was... That was creepy. Uh, the bottom, huh? This would, in theory to me, be the bottom, so let's just see if we can... Oh, wait. I think I passed right by the flower. I literally saw it, and I clicked the button too late. But at least it's not like... Uh... Oh, you got to see all the stages of it blooming. At least it's not like the pills where I feel bad. I feel like every time I pop a pill, I'm going towards a bad ending. Because, you know, pill popper. But I found a red flower right here. This must be the flower that I need. I can't take it with my hands. It has powerful thorns. We're a tree, Brad. We can take the thorns. All right, well, I got a knife. This knife is coming so handy everywhere we go. Yep. The red flower. It's like warm love. It smells funny. Yeah, because it was growing on his ass. I bet it does feel, <laughs> smell funny. Uh, let's go return this flower back to her. Poor thing. That her uh, husband stopped loving her. And he has always loved her. You just didn't go to the right time to find his love. You know? And now he wants you back, and here I am, the messenger of love, to bring you guys back together, because you deserve each other. You are the top to his bottom. He is the bottom to your top. You are the magma capper to his magma. Oh. Oh, lady. I have a surprise for you. Ta-da! Miss, I found it. Look, look, the red flower. Oh. Thank you so much. It looks so beautiful. You are indeed a great messenger of 
Lol. Thank you, miss. We should go back to your husband right away. He really misses you. I'll see you there in winter time. What the? Anybody else see the feet that just grew up from the island? Does that mean the big island up top can also grow feet and just walk around? That's crazy. But again, she brings credence to what I've been saying. Um, I'll see you in winter time, right? To me, meaning that she's gonna walk and it's gonna take her till winter time to get there, which implies time. Which means as we move through the seasons, we're moving through time. And that's so interesting to me because how are we influencing these people's lives? Are we seeing their future? Are we speeding up their lives? Are we like this? Are we moving through our own time and then like inserting ourselves back into the uh, timeline? How does that work? This is why you don't mess with the with time travel because it's just so. Ugh. Like I think of every episode of Family Guy, every time they time travel, something somebody has to die pretty much. It's always a bad ending for whoever time traveled. So never time travel. Stay your butt right where you are. Oh, y'all finally made it. Give me the hat. <laughs> it's very nice to see you two together. Now, I would like to have the hat, please. Thank you so much. I'll never forget what you've done for us. Come on, my darling. Climb on to the top. Brown chicka wow wow. It's about to get steamy. Dr. Love, yeah. Gotta help her up there. She's got feet. She can get up there. He needs to go to the dentist, though. Uh, I don't know who's talking, but uh, we'll do a mixture of the man and the woman. And here is the hat. Thank you again. We got the hat. Wow, thank you, sir. I have to go and give the hat to the great wizard now. Bye. Uh, uh, nothing else. This mountaintop is very high because it's... Oh, you don't have anything new to say? We just brought two people together in holy matrimony. Now, how long it lasts, it depends on what year they're living in. If it's modern times, it won't last very long, but we got what we needed, and that's all that matters. We're Dr. Feel Good Love. Did you find the hat? It should be on top of Coltrum. I did find it. You actually want me to give it to you. Here's the hat. Here's your hat, sir. Oh, my hat! I feel the knowledge flowing through my body. I feel happy. That's great, sir. What's next? The gift from the soil. The fruit. The lemon. Is lemon a fruit? I've never thought of lemon as a fruit, but I've never thought of it as a vegetable either. I just thought of it its own like third category. The creation of selective random elements so we can eat. Beautiful, isn't it? Hee <laughs> hee. Yes, it's incredible. Yes, the fruit is talking to me now. It says that the book, my book of knowledge, it's uh huh, and the library. But beware, the book may be hiding. So you have to be persistent and patient. Oh, God. Good, sir. I'll go to the library then. I am neither persistent. Well, I'm persistent, but patient, not really my strong suit. Wait! There's a password you'll need to get inside. Let me think. Think. It must be something about how we learn. Or... Hmm. Ah, I remember! The password is... Your basic senses are easily manipulated. Shut them down before learning. That's not a password. That's a whole phrase, man. Your basic senses are easily manipulated. Shut them down before learning. Oh. I'll try to remember that. What does it mean? It means that many times we let our understanding be manipulated we should always try to use our common sense which isn't that common nobody should ever tell you what to think or believe 
Be hungry for knowledge and you'll find yourself in constant evolution. There's every second of your life. Oh, I think it's very fun to think and learn. And being curious helps a lot. That it does, friend. I'll be going to the library now to find your book. Well, we I forgot the password, friend. I hope you remember it, because I already forgot the basic manipulation of blah means blah 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 blah. Oh, I almost forgot about the family, and then we came here and I was like, please no family, please no family. Every time we come down this mountain, somebody new wants to greet us on some creep stuff, so no no more of that. No more of that. We're on the road again. I, like I said, there's always some creep stuff going on. Every time. Here we go. Here's Count Dracula. Do you remember, Theron? You are a murderer. I didn't kill those twins. They were already dead. I just set them free. You are a nutty little girl. Naughty girls must be punished. Oh, we're the nut. And there's our bleeding eyes again. Do as I say. Do as I do, Fran. Jump. Oh, boy. I... I didn't want to kill them. I didn't want to. I stand by, we didn't kill those girls. We saw the two skeletons inside the little mirror. They were clearly long dead before we got there. I don't know what kind of voodoo rituals they were into or why one girl got stabbed, but we set them free. Oh, my dear. Don't listen to those evil things. You're strong. Let them out of your head, my dear. Am I crazy, kitty? Tell me. No, my dear. You just have to be strong. Don't let them play with your head. Oh, my kitty. I feel completely broken. My chest hurts. Oh, my dear. I'm here for you. Don't cry. I love you so much. He says my dear a lot. I love you too, my dear. We should keep on going now. Let's go to the library. Is that like a 1940s like saying, my dear? Because holy cow, that's a lot of my dear. Like I get it, I'm your dear. You don't have to keep calling me my dear. It's 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 implied. I know the password, my friend. It's uh, uh oh. Stop right there. Do you know the password? Yes, I do. Yes. All right. What is the password? Let me remember the words. It was something like you better not ask me friend. I don't know <laughs> She said <laughs> I knew more than that. I'm pretty sure it started with your basic senses <laughs> Your eyes and ears are limited sensors shut them down before learning. I mean the gist of it Hmm Good and why is that? Because only then we can really... See? It's like this city. It was invisible to me before. Knowledge is everywhere. Even in darkness and silence. You can come inside. Have fun. Okay, so you didn't even want like a word-by-word -word password. You just wanted me to understand the gist of why learning was vital. Oh my gosh. That thing in the middle looks like a puzzle. And if it is indeed a puzzle... That means I will now have to complete a puzzle. Ivy. Hello. What are you reading? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, uh, look, there's so many voices and I can only do so many. I I don't know. He's got like a sludge look to him, so I want it to be sludges. A book with many letters. Sometimes I think some letters look very scary. 
Maybe you should read something with many pictures instead. Oh, yes. Some others stay, dears. Now, if you don't mind... Oh, sorry. Excuse me. Okay. He seems to be enjoying that book. Hello, sir. What are you doing? Uh, I'm looking for my special book. Oh, sorry to ask, but why are you standing on the ladder? You have wings. Uh, because the ladder was made to be used, of course. And that is how we use we lose the ability to use our wings, just like Onward said. Uh, what if I need it? But what if I need to use it? Then you should wait your turn. But what if it's an emergency and I can't wait that much because I'm not patient, the exact opposite of what the wizard asked me to be. Uh, then you should have arrived earlier than me. Sorry, but I have to keep looking. Well, let's help him find his book, huh? And then there's a carrot. Hello. Oh, hello. Why aren't you reading? Gotta find my book. Oh, because I need to find a special book first. Ah, special books are very nice. This one I'm reading is also very special. Oh, that's great. Well, I'll keep searching for my special book then. That's probably right there in his hands. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I don't like this at all. Oh, this is grand. It must be Itherstan numbers. Yes, one, two, and three, and four, and so on. One, two, three, four, and so on. Oh, God. Is this when her puzzle comes into play? I mean, her little song. Huh, I just have to remember them. Well, it doesn't seem very hard. One, one dot is two, two dots is three, three dots is four, E is five, E with a dot is six, E with two dots is seven, E with a dot and a line is, oh god, eight. E with, oh, it's a weird E. That's nine, it just looks like a nine. We'll just call that a nine. And then 10 is an X with a dot in the middle. And then 11, wait, whoa, 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 is that 11? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, that is 10, but this looks more like 20. So 20 is two dots, makes sense. 30 is a dot, and then 40 is something else. Why would they make it something else? Okay, 40 is a line through. Okay, it seems so far. Oh, this is grand. It must be the, uh, yes, one, two, and three. Yes, I just to ruin them. Okay, that seems actually pretty straightforward. That doesn't seem too bad. I see so many books. I don't think the great wizard's book is on the shelves. The wizard said that the book may be hiding. Okay, that's fine. We like a game of hide and seek. All right, let's see what this number is all about. Let's see what these numbers are. Okay, one, one. What is this? This is 20, 21. But what do you want from me though? So, this is one. There are two ones. Huh, what is that number? It's 21. It's clearly 21, but what do you want me to do in between? Wait. It's her song. Uh, one and one is two. Which is, uh, this one. Oh, God. Her song. Uh, one and one is two. One and two is three, which is uh, this one. Three and two, three and two is five, which is, uh, uh, this is four. Five has got to be, I'm pretty sure it's just, probably just an E, right? Uh, five and three is eight, and eight looked like, there was one right before nine, so it looked like this one, I believe. Yeah, eight, and then eight and five, I'm sure that's what it wants. Eight and five is, uh, 
13? Right? 9, 10, 11, 12, 13? Yeah, 13. Which is, uh, oh boy, above a 10. Oh, so they want me to guess what 13 is? Well, this is 20? Or is it, oh boy, 13, 13, 13 is 13, 13, 13. It's not this one, it's not this one. Uh, this right here is 10. So it must be this one, 10, right? And then 11, 12, and 13. Is that it? Or did I do that wrong? I probably did that wrong. Is that not 13? Because it would have been 13 and, uh, oh god, what is this? 13 and, uh, 8? Which is. Uh, hope it's, is that 21, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Wait, 20. So, yeah, it would have been 21. 13 and 8 is 21. So it's either. I think that, yeah, I think it's the song. I just may not be putting the right letters in there. And I need to. Okay, I know 101 is 2. I know this is 2. I know this is 3. And then 1 and 3 is 5. Pretty sure E is 5, but let's double check. Pretty sure I had five right. Yep, I have five right. I have six. I didn't need six. Here's ten. And I guess that what thirteen is. Wait, this is nine. Thirteen is wrong. Because this is nine, so it's probably something to do with yeah, okay, I had it wrong. Got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Everything else was I think right. This is wrong. It's something to do with you. You are probably 13. Boom. I did it. Oh, wow. I'm so great. I have to turn the lever now. Bro, okay. I didn't even cut away because that was just straight, straight shot. Yo, we hit that. I love puzzles that I can get. And it don't take me 30 minutes. What lever do you want me to turn? This one? Oh, is there more to it? Creepy guy, creepy skeleton guy. But we got this. It's a, it's a, it's a skeleton in the box. That must be the wizard's book. Now you don't do no creepy-ish. I can't reach it. How typical. You gotta be kidding me. I gotta go with this ladder. But there's always something to climb on. Yeah, like a ladder over here is being used. That must be the. Okay, well we're gonna have to change the times because. Yeah, like so like now where <laughs> there's nobody here. So we are moving in time because we just moved forward. So it's almost like they're taking Fred. If the timeline's straight, they take Fred out of the timeline and then they like plop her here and then she can like move between the timelines. I don't know how that would technically affect affect Fran. I guess technically she would be the same age, but people around her I guess they would just continue living their life. And she just pops in and out. That's just weird to me. Alright, climb the ladder, please. Creepy. Look at that photo, this picture. They must have had so much fun drawing me. <laughs> That's creepy. Cool. Excuse me, sir. I need the book. <laughs> Can we examine his book? Top one. Well, at least you don't have to worry about me reading this book. I know the last time I read it was super long, and I'm so sorry about that, because I pretty much took like a whole episode was just reading the book. But I can't read it thirsta. So uh, we're just going to look at some pictures, I'm guessing. Oh, this looks interesting. I can't read the text, though. I recognize the four seasons and the creatures. Oh, she did better than me. I didn't even pay that much attention. I see winter and, yeah, all the other seasons. I see the creatures here. There's a skeleton, a seed, hourglass, water. Yeah, I don't know what that means. Uh-huh. Twins. Interesting. He was looking at twins, too. Like the two twins we supposedly murdered. The tree uh, that the clock was built on. An eye with a pentagram on it. A seed. What did they summon? What is this? What is the skeleton carrying a baby for? Are we the baby of the skeleton? Is the <gasps> is the skeleton our poppy? Probably not. 
Uh, whatever this is, bones. Is that like a trachea? Is that a spine? Is that a neck? What is that? We start from death and then we go back to death. Or we're born and then we go to death. Looks like some pe people people are worshiping Remor here. Yeah, there's some I get that. The monster, it seems people love him. Why would people love any I am so sorry if the camera's been bouncy. I keep hitting the bottom and it's shaking the whole thing. My bad. Uh, maybe they're scared. Fear makes us do such stupid things. The monster, it seems people love him. Why would people love an evil monster? Maybe people celebrate death. They don't necessarily celebrate the evil monster, just death. This one looks like a cycle of some kind. I wonder what it means. Years, maybe? I like to think that there are five of me, so maybe that's it. Five of you, huh? Interesting. Five realities and five friends. What do we got here? Uh, what is this? I never saw a skeleton having a baby. It seems that the baby will be born with a big head. Where do you get the big head from here? <laughs> so are they? It's cold. Big-headed persons are nice, just like me. Oh, okay. What is this? I never. Oh, okay. Well, we already we already looked at that. I guess the great wizard likes to draw. Og, oh, I wish I could understand. Maybe it says that this is good to look at the trees. I already read this. Okay, so we read the book. Interesting. Well, we snooped through his book. We just want to see what spells he knew. This library is really smaller than I thought for this long, tall hallway. It's pretty much long hallway, long hallway, long hallway stops here at a little library. Like, you can't fit much more than five people. And you've only got one ladder. You would just think there'd be more in this great library that you've got. But I don't judge. I am a peruser of knowledge. Please, no creepy stuff. Please, we, we, we've, we don't deserve it. We've been so good. We helped the guy find his book. Well, we didn't, but we sped up time so we could find his book. And we, we, we solved the puzzle in record-breaking time. Even if we got the one of the answers wrong. Winner, winner, winner. Oh, I like that you can, like, click it and then just, like, rapid clicks until it gets to the season you want instead of, like, having to go through each season. That's cool. Got your book, my friend. Got your book. Here's your book. Sir, here's your book. It was inside the musical box. I saw the doll. <laughs> the it word luck. That sounds like fun. Thank you for the book. This certainly makes me remember many things. Many, many things. Do you call it the it word lock? It's the third time I think we've heard that name, it word. Who is Itward or what is Itward? And now what? There are two things left on the star. Yes. Fish in the water. Fish, fish swimming free. Go back little fish, go back home. Wow, sir, you woke up the fish. Yes, because I remembered how to do it. Isn't it beautiful? That's magical, sir. Can you do that with other things? Like humans? Of course, but only if the circumstances are positive. How is the fish being taken positive? But the circumstances are often not positive. What, what it quantifies as positive, I'm curious. I see, sir. Hmm. So we need to find the missing stones. Yes? The fish told me that my shoes are on the feet of the amazing dancer. Time to go see the go-go dancer. Time to go see the go-go dancer. Go, 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 go. Time to go see the go-go dancer. Time to go see the go-go dancer. Do you know where this dancer could be? I have no idea. I'm pretty sure I know. I think I know. I'll go and see. No, we need the wizard's help. Create me a card, because I don't know how to get in there without a card. Help me with the card, please. Sir, I don't have the ticket to go inside the bar. Because I'm 10. 
Why don't you have your ticket? That's odd. Uh, can't get inside. Can I borrow your ticket? Can I borrow your ticket? It's your shoes, dude. My ticket is mine. I can't lend it. So you don't want your shoes? Huh. Then go inside the bar yourself and take the shoes of the dancer. Oh, I can't. I'm making rabbit science, and I'm pretty close to the answer. Besides, I know you can do it. You have completed some very difficult tasks already. If you're talking about that clockwork puzzle, I agree it was a difficult task, and I'm very proud that I was able to solve it in not record time. All right, I'll see what I can do. Bye. So he's not gonna help me with the ticket. Great. Oh, uh, God. What to do about... Again, help me get into your bar. Please. Uh, good day, friend. Good day, friend. I'm looking forward to seeing you at the bar in the fall. Uh, let me fast forward then. No, in the fall. Is that Mr. Midnight or is something hiding back there? Hey, I'm back, man. I'm ready to get some go go in me. Go, go, dance up. Uh, same question. I did not find it. I do not know what you want me to do. Can you turn this into a ticket? Uh, you know what I'm going to try? I'm going to try and combine. Not combine, but I'm going to try and move my ticket. Or maybe not move my ticket. I'm going to ask the wizard if he can do anything with the, uh, the fake ticket that I art. Okay, I'm going to do two things. I'm going to see if the wizard can do anything with my exterminated ticket. Maybe he can turn it into something. And if that doesn't work, I'm going to try and go to the king and be like, I'm not a citizen. I don't have my ticket. Can you please give me... A ticket. Those are the only two things I can think of currently. So we'll use this with the Great Wizard. Can you turn this into a ticket? I won't even try that. Oh, do you not know where I can get a ticket? Uh, let's see if what happens if we click the other option. Uh, can't get inside. I don't know what to do to get inside. The dancer must be in there. You'll have to find out what to do. I can't tell you. All right, I'll see you. You are a useless wizard, man. Are you serious this whole time? Knocking over some wood in this world. All I had to know, I had to wait, dude. Wait for him to drink his lemonade and pass him out. So I had to go fast forward in time. That's basically what I had to do. I guess that's a ticket. Everybody gets it. That looks like the grasshopper. That doesn't look like the bee. No one? Looks like a ticket. I should give it to Ron. Okay, well, I'm outside here now. Thanks for the ticket. Have the ticket. I have it. So dead when he says it, of oh, my impression. You're incredible, Kitty. I love you so much. Now we can go inside. You know how long it took me to figure out what we need to do to go inside, friend. I'm gonna need a lot more enthusiasm. Man. I really didn't think we were gonna solve it tonight. I thought it was gonna have to. One of those things where we took a break and came back the next day. But we solved it. Look, sir. It seems that a ticket found a way to get into my hands. It's been so long since we talked to him. I don't know what it is. Uh, uh, what? Let me see it. Oh. Can't be right. It just can't. I, I already let someone in with that ticket. You bring many mysteries, little lady. Huh. How can you know what somebody else is picking? 
symbols are correct, but look at the handwriting. This belongs to someone much older than you. I can see it. All right, then. Is there any chance I can get inside? I mean, is it possible? You have your own ticket, little lady. You are more than welcome. I think he had like that country western kind of thing I forgot about. So I'm hoping that now that we have this, damn it, this. Oh, that's the ticket to the party. Kitty stole it. I think it looks like the exterminator card I found in Antonio's house. I knew that card had to play a part. All right, so maybe we got to hit it or write on it or something like mine. Oh, drawn. It's not. It's not really mine. We're drawn. Why couldn't we just do that early when I've been clicking green and ticket and that lock up the idea? Hello? Dancer, mister? I really need to take your shoes. And why is this? The shoes belong to the data. I'm a dancer and I need them to uh, dance with the wizard. Oh, I'm sorry. What did you just say? I want your shoes. What? A little lemonade? You seem to be a little tense. He's way too young for lemonade. No, sir. I don't want lemonade. Where did you get your shoes from? Mm. You should drink a little lemonade. At least to drown your thirst. I need them to go home, great wizard eat. I'm not thirsty, sir. I just need the shoes to go home, please. Oh, that's impossible. I can't give you my shoes. The only way to get my shoes is to take them from me. And as you see now, I'm standing on them, so it's impossible. But if you lift your feet, I can take them. It can't be done. Only the very day, when both of my feet are up in the air. Only then can my shoes be taken. Otherwise, I will stand forever. I see. Well, thank you. Bye. I think it's very important that you don't mess with Brian. Brian has a way of getting things that... Hello. 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 You like an autograph? Uh, not really. What is the trumpeteer doing, sir? Uh, he's fixing me the at all. The rhythm must be perfect so that we can start the show. Ah, let's see. Thank you. We'll fix it, all right. basically have to be inside places uh Kitty is tired of being illegal. Um I basically have to go inside this place with Kitty. Ah, that's not a real piano. It's just a lick. I know that. I, I know that. I know. That. Yeah. Good luck with this. Okay. Oh, I need to fast forward this time. 
piano then? Fixed it. Oh, there it is. That's a good sign. Are those your shoes? On the floor? In the air? And now they're my shoes. I have the shoes. I'm so clever. Let's take them to the wizard. That's mess a friend. I don't want your lemonade. I don't want your company. I don't even want your dancing. I just want your shoes. Freeze back. I have my shoes disappeared. That's very confusing. I can't dance now. I'll drown my feet in lemonade. Uh, you can tell me outside, by the way. Here's your ticket, miss. I'm sorry, but I took it, and I wanted to give it back. Oh, goodness. You are very nice. Thank you very much. Oh, the kind thief. I got an achievement of life. I figured that we could talk about that game. Dope stuff. Have the shoes. They're very pretty. Look. It's like bowling shoes. Wow, you did it. You really have an extraordinary machine inside your head. Thank you, sir. Now, let's do the last one so I can go home. The last one! Air! I recognize this feather. It belongs to the laundress. Yes. It's all very interesting. There's a wand. I guess the question is, how do we get it? Okay, no, 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 no. How do we get it? And so that's Hello. Yeah, we didn't even use like one hand, so. Wait. Oh, great. This is the last task. Now I can go home. This is the wizard's wand, but I can't do magic with it. That was probably the easiest out of all of the tasks. It was the easiest. Much more struggle. We just kind of kept clicking until the transition happened between hands. So. And it's actually kind of underwhelming seeing that thing the whole time where it was like big buttons and just on got nothing. The rest of the task made up for it. Don't you talk to him without handing him that wand. Here's your wand, Sir Wizard. Oh, magnificent! Splendid! You did it! Really? But where are the stones? Can I borrow them? I can't lend you the stones! These stones are very, very... 
special. I did not do all of this so that you could dig and take my stone. What I can do is place the stones on the locks of the door. But you, you are the only one who can turn the key and actually open the door. Oh, I see. The king told me he would show me where the door is. Ah, then we should go and talk with him, don't you think? Yes, let's go to the castle. Oh, did you get the magic trick sword with the rabbit? Tatted in. Rabbit sword? I'll be right there. I have to finish something. Go down to the castle. Oh, okay. we'll find out if the rabbit ever. What a lo- uh, okay. He's gonna do it with the rabbit. He's probably bringing the light. Oh, no, he's a little- he If nothing is nothing, if something is nothing, if nothing is ever something. Creepy families hopping into the screen. Families asking them. More creepy families. Just like Halloween. Oh, more creepy families. Jump off my screen. Leave Mr. Midnight alone. Oh, we got the real Mr. Midnight. That that cat don't look very real or safe. Your head playing with you again? Can't you see yourself in the mirror? I'm not you. I'm not. Let Mr. Midnight go now. Kill the traitors, because that's what he is, friend. Don't you see? My kitty is not a traitor. He promised to be by my side. He promised. What your mommy and daddy did? Who promised to take good care of you? Wake up, Thrun. You are surrounded by traitors. Leave me alone. Leave my friend alone. I'm the only one you have, friend. I'm the one who's always by your side. <coughs> Caused a tickle in my throat. Now, let's get rid of this traitor, eh? What do you say? Let's be happy. Like a Joker moment. Let's be so very, very happy together. Oh. Go away! Go away! It wasn't me! Friend, is there something you're not telling me? Are there secrets, friend, that you're hiding from us? Wrong. What's wrong? Why are you crying? Crazy, sir. I really think we should stay here, Fran. This place is so nice. This is Fran. We can go home now. I'm so excited. It makes one of us. Oh, I wish I could leave you something. And remember me. We won't forget you. You are a very special. Forgot. Landris gave me this for you. Much why you give me that complicated box. Come on now. Oh, thank you. Help Landris that I wish I could help him with his wounds. I gave my aid patches to a girl in the hospital. But anyway. I'll tell you. Don't worry. Landris is better now. Before you go, you must know. Before you return to your reality, you will go through the secret woods. The woods.
woods are kind of invisible passage between our reality. And they encounter terrible creatures that want to eat you. Throwing it out there. But just run. They are quite slow. You are telling me this now? Huh. That sounds very scary. Are you sure you don't want the magical place in the trees where death doesn't exist? That's what I... He'll do fine. <laughs> Hope so. Well, Mr. Midnight, say goodbye. Let's go now. Goodbye, gentlemen. I had a great time. I, I like you very much. Goodbye. Oh, here we go. Oh, she's got a straight jacket on that she's like kind of army. Creepy. Oh, Jeebus, they meant literally. Oh. Man, it's like this. Oh god, I didn't see that. Oh, okay. Okay, just run, but you also gotta jump. It's not just run, it's jump run. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, we got this. For master platformer, or side scroll, whatever you call this. Oh god, I might have messed that jump up. Okay, okay, okay. I'm with you, cat. I'm with you. Wherever you're at, I'm at. I'm right behind you. I'm glad Fran has hops. Not hops. Right now. Holy cow. Said it was quite slow. It is not as slow as you can control. Oh, I thought she could make that. Who that leave was scary? Dive through the door. Dive through the door. I love those little mini games. Those are probably my favorite highlights of the games. Chapter 4, Part 1. My Imaginary Friend. Achievement unlocked. A troll. Troll! Why does the game just look? You should be out of breath. My goodness, the door opened. Wow, interesting. Get twisty. Come on, Mr. Midnight. Let's find out where we are. And of course, our peels are back. It's dark. It's not. Oh, obviously. They were so they, oh, Fran. Hope we can find home soon. I'm starving. Mr. Midnight, look! I think we were at the other side of the bridge. Do you remember? What we tried to cross before we fell into Thirsta. Yes, I remember. Stop talking like the tree, Mr. Midnight. Great! Let's keep on going, Kitty. We have to be careful now. And I think that is what's going to do it for us tonight. I want to thank you all so, 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 so much for tuning in with me and rocking as we finish Fran Bo. It has been such an amazing, fun adventure, and I feel like we are getting closer to the answer that we have been seeking for full levels now. I really am going to miss the thirst of because it was just such a bright and beautiful world, and I know this is going to be a creepy, depressing, dark world. I'm hoping I don't see that creepy while I'm with the kids again because he is by far the creepiest thing I've seen in the Regardless, I'm enjoying every moment of this adventure, and I'm so happy that you guys are watching with me as well, and hopefully enjoying it, or at least with the commentary that you have with those who've probably seen the game before. As always, I am Jay Wright, and I will see you all in the next video.